In this tutorial, I have application of complex numbers in matrix. We are to find the values of x and y, which is the determinant of this complex matrix. Let's get straight to what we have in this video and please watch this video to the end. Don't forget to like and subscribe. So at this point, you have to know how to handle 3 by 3 matrix, that is finding determinant of 3 by 3 matrix. So this is what we're going to do. You take this first one, then you eliminate its row. So I'm going to have 6i multiplying the small 2 by 2 matrix created here. That is why I drew this. This small 2 by 2 matrix created here, right? And I'll find the determinant as you know already. This multiply this minus this. That is 3i multiplying i minus 3 multiplying negative 1. Alright? Then don't forget this plus minus plus. So the second one, I'm going to take this side and that is going to be minus negative 3i multiplying the whole expression this will nullify this and it will nullify this as well so i'll be left with this 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 and this so i've nullified this whole part and this whole part right so i'll be left with so i'll be left with 4 times i right minus 20 times negative 1 so minus 20 times negative 1 then finally i'll take this that is my 1 and it's positive open brackets 1 is going to nullify everything here then here so i'll be left with just this inside here so 4 times 3 minus 20 times 3i and everything i have here should be equal to x plus i y at this point 6i comes this is negative 3 and this is plus 3 right because this is going to be, give me plus 3 this is for this inner one minus this is going to give me 4 times 3 is 12 and it's negative 3 so 4 times negative 3 negative 12 but i and i give me negative 1 so i get 12 so that is minus 12 this side is simply so let's see something here when i solve for this inside i have six i multiplying this whole thing so i should have a bigger bracket covering it three i multiplying this whole thing then one multiplying this whole thing so let me do this part well so i'll have the negative three i out so it should be plus three i out open brackets what i have here is four i plus 20 right then when i come here plus my one and here four times three is 12 minus 60 i is equal to x plus i y now this point this is zero right so i'm going to have zero times 6i plus 3 times this is 12 i times i is negative 1 so negative 12 plus 60i all right and at this point i'll have 12 minus 60i i'll just add it straight away is equal to x plus i y this is zero will go away negative 12 and positive 12 will cancel right then finally i'll have 60i 
canceling this. So our uh, left with zero is equal to x plus i y, and we can clearly see x is equal to zero, y is equal to zero, and that is the solution for this problem. Thank you for being with me, and please subscribe if this is the first time you are visiting this channel. Please share.